everyone. Hello, hello. Welcome. Uh, this is day 29, I think, of lockdown. I may have missed a day. I haven't missed a video, but I may have missed a day, I'll just say. Um, because I've been getting confused about what day it is, because I haven't been keeping track of the days. So tonight, I'm actually going to do a very powerful pineal gland detoxification and activation. So this is what I've been guided to do tonight because uh, I know that if you know about the pineal gland or the third eye, this is your spirit center. This is where your intuition is. This is where your connection to your higher self, to your higher consciousness, to your um, multi-dimensional self through you can just travel use you know using your third eye uh, you can travel through time and space you can go anywhere you want you can tap into anything you want you can remote view you can connect to the spirit world you can connect psychically to people um, you can connect to extremely powerful healing powers and activation powers which is what I do um, the, I have called the energy that I connect to, and I know there's many other people on this planet that have tapped into the same very high frequency, um, around the planet and have called it different things, but I call it, and I'm going to be doing, teaching it eventually. I'm still playing with it myself, playing with it as in working with it. I love my work, that's why I call it play. Uh, <clears throat> so the what I call it is um, quantum light technology. Now, it is intelligent in nature. A bit like if you're a Reiki healer, because I'm a Reiki master teacher as well, so I know my Reiki energy and I know what that's like. It's a beautiful, soft energy. Um, but quantum light technology is kind of a bit like that, as in it's intelligent. It knows where to go and what to do in the body for that particular person. But it's much more powerful. It it. It is connected to everything, to all that is. Um, and again, through time and space, through dimensions, it's, it really is coming from the source of creation. It's, it's extremely powerful. It is filled with information. It's filled with um, codes, if you like, uh, codes that will work key codes and, and codes that will work with a person's individual energy signature. So tonight, uh, I'm just going to talk a little bit about the pineal gland first. Yes, it is the spirit center. Uh, it is where you connect to all those beautiful things that we can do on a multidimensional level. It is a place where if you meditate, you will connect into your pineal gland, into your third eye, and you can travel through uh, into other dimensions and other time and spaces within your meditation, but you're going through the third eye. Uh, it is definitely your connection to your multi-dimensional self. It's connect your connection to your soul group, your soul. Um, and your past lives, parallel, present, future, it really is a doorway to absolutely everything. Um, so what I wanna talk about is the de uh, calcification of the pineal gland. Now, Uh, a lot of people say, and I don't know because I'm not a scientist, but I'm going to go with all the different information that I've read and what I feel to be so, uh, that um, fluoride in the water can, over time, 
calcify your pineal gland. Now, when it's calcified, it's it's uh, like little crystals that are growing around the outside, a bit like some people can get um, kidney stones, type that type of thing, um, around the outside of your pineal gland, which is very, very tiny. It's, it's almost like the size of a pea uh, inside your brain, but back inside here. Um, so toxins also can create your pineal gland to not work properly it can calcify things it can so and you know even, even what you eat um if you eat a high toxicity diet then it's not going to be particularly good for your your pineal gland um greens broccoli um spinach spirulina parsley alfalfa uh, all of those things brilliant for your pineal gland um, and help detoxify your body actually if you eat loads of greens which i'm going to eat tonight i'm gonna to have a nice big spinach salad um, also what helps your pineal gland is iodine having enough iodine in your body now you can get droplets of iodine that you can just put a couple of drops in a glass of water and have that every day and it is to ingest you can get them from the health food shop uh, it's important to make sure that your whole system is working correctly for this so i think what we'll do is we'll get on now with the we're sort of nearly seven minutes into the video we'll get on now with the calc the decalcification of the pineal gland and the activation. So back here on my pillow, I have a crystalline selenite and all my sacred geometry um, amethyst stones. And they are lying on the pillow where your third eye would be if you were lying down on my bed. So what I would like you to do is Allow yourself to lie down somewhere when you do this, but know in your heart, because I'm going to open a portal to where you are, and it doesn't matter how many people watch this video at the same time or at different times. That portal will be open, so you can bring yourself here on my healing table, and I will work with you directly who is is watching this video to decalcify your pineal gland and to reactivate it now i'm not going to have to get up and do that there i've got everything there laid out i am able to if you like split myself multidimensionally to be able to stand there and work on your pineal gland as your energy body and everything has, has come here. And at the same time, I can also travel to where you are and work on you directly there. There is no ends to what we can do when we attune ourselves and believe in ourselves and attune ourselves to the right frequencies, the right dimensions. Uh, so I have, this is how we're going to do it. So please go lie down somewhere. I want you to get yourself nice and comfortable. Close your eyes when you're ready. Make sure you're nice and warm. And just be for a moment. Taking a nice deep breath of that beautiful unconditional love. See it is a pink mist entering your body. And breathing out and allowing your whole body to completely relax, melting into the bed. All the tension leaving. Again, taking a nice deep breath in. 
unconditional love flooding your system, flooding your cells, going into your DNA, coming out through your skin, going into your auric field. So you're lying in a bubble of unconditional love. Feeling at peace. Feeling calm. Feeling protected as you know that unconditional love is the highest frequency that exists in the cosmos. Feeling into your body now, feeling that beautiful unconditional love. pink mist as it's gone out through into your energy field and it's running through all your bodies that's your soul body your physical body your mental mind body and your emotional body beautiful beautiful pink mist and now around the outside of your bubble that you're in i want you to imagine that there is a golden light all the way around it and there are streams of energy that are kind of wriggly they're not dead straight coming in all the way around into your bubble now this is very tiny portals of quantum light technology it is comes with the most highest frequency in the cosmos. It comes with pure unconditional love. And it is pouring in now in the outsides of your auric field and it is penetrating, coming right the way through and penetrating your body and filling your body with light. And it's almost as if that gold rim is now swirling around you as all of that beautiful energy is just pouring into you. It is quantum light technology. It is filled with codes, hieroglyphs, sacred geometry, and the creation of life. And that's now pouring into your system from all the way around and feeling it coming around you in a clockwise, angle going right the way around you going in you and now i'm opening a portal of light connected to where you are and also to my healing room here so that you can come and lie on my healing table and that I can also come to you in astral form wherever you are on this planet I don't need to know your address or anything like that I'm connecting with you personally on a multi-dimensional level I don't need your name this is our connection heart to heart and the portal has been opened we're calling in all of the beings of light that I work with and also your guides and people that you work with. So we're tapping into the God source, the collective, the highest frequency in the cosmos, all the archangels and angels, ascended masters, spirit guides and helpers, the ancient ones and the tribal elders, the Brotherhood of Light, the Galactic Federation of Light and the High Council, the Shining Ones and all the trans-dimensional beings and interdimensional beings that work for the good of humanity and the Earth and all of our beautiful ET friends that come with that most highest intention and frequency and pure love for the Earth and humanity and all living things on the Earth beautiful beautiful beings both et and celestial we invite you all now to come in very very close and i'm tapping in now and opening up a portal of light directly over myself tapping into quantum light technology and drawing that down also over you drawing it down through the crown through your crown chakra 
coming down and entering into the pineal gland now. Now I'm going to go in on a deep level into the pineal gland and we're just going to now using quantum light technology and we're going to remove now with this quantum light tool that I'm using going to remove any calcification or anything that is blocking the outside of your pineal gland. And while I'm working on yours, I'm also working on my own. So any calcification or anything that is blocking the full function of your pineal gland. We're actually cutting that away now. I can see there is little bits coming off it's almost like I'm using a laser, but it's quantum light technology. Remembering it is intelligent and it knows exactly where to go and what to do for you. If you start to feel pressure in your third eye area or around the back of your head, please don't worry. That is all part of the process as this energy is penetrating and going deep now within the pineal gland and around it removing now and burning up into light so it dissolves into nothing anything that has formed around your pineal gland and that is now nice and clear but we're now going to go within the pineal gland we're going to go within the third eye on a spiritual level going through time and space through all lifetimes through all journeys and we're going to remove anything that is blocking your full intuitive abilities so we're going now deep down right the way down through to the soul spark the soul level going through all lifetimes all parallel lives through time and space through all dimensions that you may have lived once we're going through on an earth plane but also on a star seed plane for all of you that are star seeds and I know you are otherwise you wouldn't have been drawn to this video so we're going now and we're clearing anything whether it be a person an event a health issue um, absolutely anything that may have happened through any lifetime through time and space through all dimensions that have may have happened to you that has blocked or damaged this third eye pineal gland in any way whatsoever and we are now sending pure light coded technology directly into the pineal gland going right the way down to the soul level it will do what it needs to do to clear any debris any old emotions any fear of your own intuition any trauma that you may have suffered through past lives or this lifetime to do with your own intuition Many, many people have been punished for tapping into their own intuition over lifetimes. Removing all of that fear-based emotion from your third eye, from your pineal gland, now. I'm pulling it out, lifting it all out now. Sending that pure light coded technology directly into the pineal gland now. And I want you to see it building up and building up and building up like a sphere of pure light. And you can almost feel like your head is expanding. 
this light is traveling now through time and space, through all dimensions and opening up doorways that have never been opened before, but also doorways that have been opened before that may have been blocked because they're not blocked anymore. To your true multi-dimensional self, so that full expansion of your third eye is now taking place, of your pineal gland. This is not just on a physical level, we are going through all time and space, all dimensions, right the way down into your soul spark, your God source within you. And we are with this light, quantum light technology, we are building that bridge now to full intuition abilities. We are opening those pathways now. Don't worry if you're feeling head pressure. I'm feeling it myself. I'm feeling it both in the third eye and around the back of my head. In fact, all around my head. And it feels like head pressure. It feels like a bit of a headache. It's not a headache. It is the energy the quantum light technology which is opening doorways and pathways inside your pineal gland, also inside your brain, to a new higher consciousness. But also on a multi-dimensional level, through time and space, through all dimensions. We're really opening things up here. This is extremely powerful. Feeling that expansion as everything is being opened up. Your intuition is being fully engaged and all of your abilities. Now you may find that you have abilities that are different to others and that's absolutely fine and that is absolutely normal. really is expanding now in a big way really opening up that third eye to connect with all that is to all creation and I can see that that quantum light technology has now built the bridge through all time and space through all dimensions for you to now be fully open and aware. Just feel into your own body, feel into your own third eye. You might feel it's throbbing, you might even feel movement. As this is really being opened up, extremely powerful stuff. As the quantum light technology is building those bridges, opening those doors through time and space, through all lifetimes, releasing all fear about you using in your intuition and stepping in to your full multidimensional self. We're gonna leave this full expansion open because we don't want to close it now we've opened it so we're going to leave this open we're going to leave the light technology we'll carry on working with you the quantum light technology will carry on working with you over the next several days possibly even weeks this is a full third eye activation extremely powerful and a full third eye clearing of all blockages that may have existed for you and each person will have different ones remembering the quantum light technology is intelligent it knows exactly what to do where to go for you personally it will work with your blueprint with your energy signature 
So you will be in within full balance, but you will have a much more expanded consciousness on a higher level than what you've ever had before. This is very powerful stuff. This is very powerful energy work. This is the type of work I do when I do my activations and when I do healing sessions. My healing sessions are probably like you've never experienced before because I even sing within the healing session and often I will speak light codes but it's the actual energy work that's taking place that is the most important. The singing, the light codes, the singing in particular is to raise the frequency. I have these beautiful angel voices on tonight to do that. The light codes are another form of light technology that just enhances it. It enhances it even more. So you can open your eyes now. Everything is in full in balance, but your whole consciousness, your third eye has been opened up and cleared. So you may feel that you feel as you, as, as you start to get up and start moving around in a minute, that you may feel that everything feels a lot bigger and wider. That's because you are. Your whole consciousness has been expanded. If you immediately think of space, just like that, you will see space. You'll be, it's like you're floating out in space. This is how expanded you now are. So what we're just going to do now, because we don't want you all floating off, especially if you've got to go to work or you're doing something or working machinery or anything like that. We're just going to now connect in with your heart, with your beautiful heart energy. And we're just going to draw some of that energy now down into the solar plexus, into your sacral chakra, into the base of your spine, down both legs, into your knees, down your shins and calves, down into your ankles, your feet, and out of the bottoms of your feet, right down into the earth. And we're going to connect to the earth and ground this energy in to the earth, your energy into the earth. So you stay grounded while you're still expanded in your consciousness. So we're going to ground your energy right down into the earth and anchor your energy in. See it like everything is being your energy is being locked around the earth's heart, the earth's consciousness. And then see like roots coming out all the way around. Still your energy, but you're connecting to everything within the earth. The earth's energy system, the, the ley lines, the new crystalline grids, the multidimensional beings on the earth, the trees, the plants, the flowers, the bees, uh, fungi, absolutely everything that the earth holds. So you're still grounded, you're still connected to the earth, but your consciousness is now reaching space, reaching the cosmos, reaching wherever you want to reach it, wherever you want it to go. And it is fully connected to your entire system, to your heart, to your nervous system. So you might find now that you start feeling more in your body about feeling into energy, feeling into other people. You'll start sensing things about other people, about even a room that you might walk into. You'll sense whether there's been an argument or anything like that in there, or whether there's bad vibes, whether there's really good vibes. Um, you will start sensing these things. And when you meet up with a, a beautiful baby or a child, you will start sensing things about them. Your, your intuition is now kicked in. It's up to you now to develop it. There is no blockages within your third eye any longer. It is up to you to develop your intuition. And the way to do that is to play with it. Practice. Practice remote viewing. Practice, get somebody else in the family to put something in another room that you don't know about, 
All you know is that they've placed something in another room and practice remote viewing it. Practice tuning into the spirit world and connecting to spirit loved ones. Practice feeling energy. There is no boundaries when it comes to this work. And I know you can do it. We all have this gift. I know you can do it. Now that you've been fully opened and expanded, there's nothing wrong with your pineal gland whatsoever. If you find you are getting headaches over the next few days, don't fight it. Drink plenty of water, try and have a nice healthy diet and just allow the process to take place. Because like I said, it will still carry on for the next few days, possibly even a couple of weeks. Don't fight it if you've got a headache. Just know that it is the energy in there that's still clearing stuff. So I am gonna say lots of love from me and I hope you've enjoyed this very powerful activation and clearing of the pineal gland. Please, please share because the more we can activate people, the more people use their intuition, the much better this world is gonna be. And on a mass consciousness, we will be doing so much good work to really help raise the frequency of everyone that lives on this planet. So please, please share. Let's get this out here. Let's get people doing this so they can really feel the energy and really have their intuition opened up and their, their third eye, their pineal gland opened and cleared. It's important to have it cleared first, then opened, which is what we've done today. So please, please share. Um, if you are new to my YouTube channel, please subscribe. Please click on the little bell because you'll get notifications and when I put a new video up and please, please share it. Let's help other people to really open up and know who they truly are. So lots and lots of love. Take care. Blessings to you all. Bye for now. Bye.